Next type of firewall is stateful inspection firewall. Now what exactly is stateful inspection firewall? Again no need to mug up. Let's try to understand what exactly do we mean when we say stateful inspection firewall. Now before you know going with the explanation let's try to imagine something like this. Now let's say for example you know you are having some security guard outside your organization you know at the gate of your organization and that people are keeping records of all the vehicles leaving your organization the vehicle number at what time the vehicle is leaving your organization what what is the expected time of arrival you know all these things are you know being recorded for what purpose they are going outside the organization when they will arrive all right so what exactly is this see for example as you can see in the screen vehicle has left the organization you are keeping the log of let me zoom in you are keeping the log of you know the vehicle number expected arrival time reason for leaving all right you have kept you know all the record now when the vehicle arrives when the vehicle arrives again you will track all the things you know when it went out when it is coming all right what was the expected arrival time now when it is coming why it is late all these logs would be kept and this entry was opened over here when the vehicle left your organization the entry was opened now when the vehicle is coming back this entry this particular entry would be closed this particular entry would be closed all right so that entry was open now over here it is closed again you know proper logs would be maintained now when we say stateful inspection in case of stateful inspection the firewall acts as that security guard outside the gate of your organization all right it will keep the track or the logs of destination of each packet when it is leaving your organization when that packet is leaving your organization when it is expected to you know get the reply when it is expected to get the reply why it is leaving you know when it is leaving it will keep the track or the logs of the destination of each packet where it is going the source ip the destination ip all right and when we say packet when we say packet again try to apply your osi knowledge when we are saying packet again it means that again this stateful inspection firewall also works at the layer 3 of the osi network layer of the osi model all right now when the packets are incoming again over here entry is opened entry is opened now over here entry would be closed okay but why the name has been kept as stateful inspection by the name stateful inspection it is because it it maintains something known as state table or status table it maintains state table or status table or status of the communication table status what is the status of the communication all right so basically it maintains state table status table or status of the communication table and that is why it is called as stateful inspection firewall all right so let's discuss what they have mentioned over here so as you can see in the screen now let's say for example you know in case of icmp eco request let's say for example we are taking the example of icmp eco request if the request has been made from your organization then the reply would be allowed 
all right first of all you know it will also keep a log of you know where it is going the, the destination ip you know it will keep a record a log of each and everything but if the echo request has been made uh, from your organization the reply would be allowed but if directly someone is giving you reply without requesting from your side as you can see in the screen if directly someone tries to you know give you the reply without you you know made the request in that case that packet would be dropped this packet would be dropped this is called as stateful inspection firewall now one question should come in your mind that you know what if what if the incoming traffic is something you know we have not you know there is not something which is going outside of our organization but there is something which is incoming and it's a genuine packet what if you know we have not sent any request all right outside the organization but the incoming message is something you know which is actually required to us in that case what to do when incoming is not in response to something gone outside in that case it will further check if it is required if it's a, if it's a genuine you know a requirement if if it is yes then it will allow otherwise it will drop the packets all right so if it is required it will allow otherwise it will directly drop the packets so try to understand the advantage see rbpff router based packet filtering firewall also works at network layer and this is also working at network layer all right but it has good security as compared to rbpff obviously good security because it is keeping a track a log of you know each and everything all right but in case the the disadvantage is the disadvantage is it is complex to administer or maintain again you will have to you know keep all the records and you know let's say for example there is incoming and you know it is not something in response to outgoing then again you will have to check whether it is allowed if if yes then again you know allow otherwise drop the packet so basically it is complex to administer or maintain all right otherwise the advantage is it it has good security as compared to packet filtering firewall so let's read out what they have given stateful firewalls have a state table that allows the firewall to compare current packets to previous ones stateful firewalls are slower than packet filters but are slower why it is slower because it is checking more things as compared to the packet filtering firewall if a security guard you know only checks your id card it will take less time for you to enter the organization but if the security guard checks each and everything whatever you have kept you know your your pockets your you know each and everything he is checking in that case it will take more time so stateful firewalls are slower than the packet filters but are far more secure because more checking is done and then they have explained this you know diagram computer one sends an icmp request echo request to bank.example.com the firewall is configured to ping internet sites so the stateful firewall allows the traffic and adds an entry to its state table and add and adds an entry to its state table now what will happen while incoming an echo reply is received from bank.example.com at computer 1 in figure 4.3 the firewall checks to see if it if it is allow if it allows this traffic then it checks the state table for matching echo request in the opposite direction the firewall finds the matching entry and then deletes the entry because the entry was opened now it will delete the entry from its state table and passes the traffic but let's say for example evil dot example over there bank dot example dot com it was a genuine request now over here evil.example.com sends an unsolicited icmp echo reply directly they are sending a reply without you giving a request the stateful firewall sees no matching state table entry and then it will deny the traffic so this is what stateful inspection firewall is all about